Evening chap, so another, another quick shave tonight. Tonight's going to be a, what we're going to use is Swedish theme from Sweden. Matteo Orange Shave Soap, followed by his balm, which is made by Matty Holmes. And going to be using a Swedish razor from Matty Holmes. So I think it's a little 5 8. Uh, you can see the shape of that. And it tells you there what it is. It's a, can't pronounce the name on here, but it's a number 31. It's an old, old razor with bone scales, but uh, Matt sent this to me. Well, actually, I bought it from John June. He sold it on behalf of Matty Holmes. Uh, so, yeah, we're going to be doing this. Uh, so, it's all going to be Swedish products, apart from the brush. So, start off with a bit of the usual pre shave, Perazzo pre shave. Should have used a smaller brush really, but never mind. Nice say this is from Matt. The, the guy lives in Sweden. You can see him on YouTube. It's a subtle smell of oranges there. Still got a little cold, but it's getting better. Better than I was last week, anyway. Get my water. Right, that's that done. Oh, just gonna strap up the razor quickly. Yeah, they've uh, took this razor to the fire key and then they were. And I take, took it to the Naki Army Jaina after that with a creamy, sort of creamy wet slurry. Did about 50, then another 30, then another 20. So about 100 strokes on a, on a cream slurry on the Jaina. It's a really easy method, this, and uh, I've not done it for a while, so I just like to see the change in the photo. And, uh, do this video for Martin because he's getting a Jane out soon and I recommend him to try this method first just to see what his Jane out's capable of. So there he goes.
and that is butter smooth. Look at that. That is a beautiful edge. It's actually hard to believe that What I call a very skin friendly mellow edge. One of those sort of edges that you just can't cut yourself with, even if you tried. Nice, really. Reminds me of a good cottage that does. Good cottage yeah. Obviously, dollar cut on a cottage is a lot more difficult than 5k to J that was slurry, so uh, anyone that uses a cottage will know that. Yeah, that's Let's not forget these razors have got good steel. It took me about, about five minutes to do that as well, five minutes. Yeah, I'd recommend you try that, Martin, when you get your uh, Jane out this week. Just, just so you know what, what your stones are capable of, and uh, without overcomplicating it, uh, just started off with the basics, because Obviously, as you probably read, J nuts can vary a little bit, but this one I've got, I can finish with water slurry. It don't really matter, but some J nuts are rock hard, and you finish with water, you get a sharp edge, but not a very skin flint for anyone. I've uh, experienced J nuts like that myself, so. With Jane, actually, you can take tailor the edge to how you want it. I mean, normally, I'd, I'd probably go 5k, 8k, but it's not a lot of difference. In fact, I think I get a better, a better smoother edge going from the 5k to the um, to the Jane app. But there's only you that can decide on that when you get yours. You can see how I'm just getting stuck in with this razor and you've got no no no, no chance of cutting yourself out with a synthetic edge like your 20k that you're using. 
you probably get a much less forgiving edge and sharper edge, but it's hard to explain, but you can't beat this kind of edge. Probably try it on one of your fellow money because just set your, set your edge quickly on the uh, 5k and then just finish on the Jane Atlas story when you get it, Martin. And um, hopefully it works for you. I'm, I'm, I'll be surprised if it doesn't. Give it a really good strapping on the and leather. I've shaved against the grain today, but for me, really, it's a little bit too soon. So I should, I mean, really, I shaved any shade of an art against the grain, and my skin can't take against the grain more than once a week. I'll just get a better shave against the grain if I leave it for at least five days. Don't know why that is, but it's just the way it is. Yeah, if you just try that, Martin, so you go and uh, it'll give you a rough idea what, you, what your stone's capable of. Now, yeah, for me, that was that was a great shave against the grain. Sorry, uh, with the grain and across the grain. Kind of fault it one little bit. Uh, against the grain, because I've not rest of my skin long enough. Could have been a little bit better. Um, but it was still good. It was still a comfortable shave. 
Um, some guys can take it every day against the against the grain. I, I just can't. So if I rest my skin, I just get I just get a better shave against the grain after I've rested. So I normally shave with and with and across the grain, and that's about it in the week. So I wanted to just try that, but uh, but yeah, I hope that helps you, Martin. And uh, that is a nice little razor. That and that was a great shave. Five kg now, simple. Right, I'll leave you to it, and I'll uh, catch you guys later.